Miss Tate and if you're new here make sure you subscribe so I finished my first two days of work at my new fire station and this is completely different than anything I've ever did because this is with airport firefighting so on one side of the, the fire station we have like regular fire trucks that we would have that you would normally see on the streets and then on the other side is where it connects to the airport so you've got which they're called crash trucks and this is for airport firefighting so we constantly are having planes landing so we have that to serve on that side so we've got like 10 people 10 or more people at this fire station and, and then more plus the chiefs where we're all serving the community and the airport firefighting so it can be chaotic but it was an absolute blast i am definitely learning a lot which i'm liking but i wanted to show you guys kind of all the pieces of apparatus as well as my room that i stay in for the two days so i have a bed i have everything i have my own bathroom and i just put my bedding on and i show you it all but i also decorated for christmas and I just wanted to show you that all. So please stay tuned for more because there's always more videos that I will upload and just enjoy. And if you have questions, definitely comment and ask. Starting off on the airport side, we have our 55 foot ladder truck, our crash truck that holds 1500 gallons of water. And it's just completely different, but I love it. We have our ambulance that is a beauty. So just a Ford all our medical supplies so we've got our jump bag our cot and just anything that we may need in case of an emergency to help somebody and then we have compartments on the outside with extra supplies this is our engine so we've got just a regular engine that says protect those who defend america there's the inside we've got all our scba and then here's the pump panel where we'll pump water and then each compartment has different things you may need. This is our lockers where we hold our gear. We've got our hazmat truck, so everybody has to have their hazmat tech to work here. And then this is the landing field, so where all the planes will be landing. And then we have one zoom by, so this is constant and they are very noisy. Every day we are also going to the gym, so for me, so this is fun for me. And then I just took this random clip. There's really no context to it. I just thought it was cool. But every morning, this is how I come in. I unlock my locker. And I usually spray down everything. Just because I don't know who was laying on it. And then I just start putting everything out. So this is my wax warmer. So my room smells all cozy and pumpkin-y. Putting out my Christmas decorations. I'm wiping down everything with these Centiva wipes. So I got my bedside table and then usually wipe down the desk and then this is when i put all my bedding out schedule starts at 7 a.m we have a meeting before we start just to make sure everyone's there and i usually get here at 6 30 just to make sure i can set everything out and i'm all organized so as you can see my bed's made i've got my locker open and i've got everything out that i need to i've got all my extra clothes i've got my bag i've got extra laundry detergent my shampoo and conditioner and extra shoes so this just equals for me to be more organized and then I can do other stuff. So this would be if somebody else was to share the room with me. So if there was somebody else, we've got an extra bed. And then this is the bathroom. So this is the bathroom that I share. I don't share it with anybody. What am I saying? But I've got soap. Of course, it had to be Christmas. Here's the shower that I would use. And then, of course, just like regular bathroom stalls, there are the stalls. This is the hall, this leads to the kitchen, and then usually I'm studying, and right now I'm studying for my advanced EMT, and if I'm not doing anything, I'm listening to my music, I am writing down my calendar, and then by now it's like late, so I'm getting ready for bed, and I've got everything all set up in case there was a call, so I have my boots set up right there, and these are just my work boots, they're from Amazon actually, and then here are my other just sneakers. Here is my bedside table. I've got my two books, which are my book light is from Amazon, which I got for $8. And there's different modes of lighting that I can use, which I like that. And then these are the two books I reviewed in my last video that I got from Barnes and Noble. And I definitely recommend reading them if you want. So here's one of my little Christmas decorations that I actually got from Walmart for a dollar and it just gave it a little spice 
and then this is my anchor block that has different charging ports in it and then back to my bed all my sheets so my black sheets are from target my comforter is from target and then my blanket is from tsc that has the trees on it and the bed has storage underneath if you need it i personally don't use it and then on my desk i just have all my school supplies that would help to need to study so all my highlighters and pens are from amazon and then just my glasses and then this side is when i start kind of packing everything up because this is a 48 hour shift so i do it to help me get organized and it's easier to get out in the morning so i just start packing up my duffel bag that i toured in my last video and then this is one of the books that i just got for my art class so just airport firefighting and you can kind of see like how things go so I'm sure that will be very interesting to start reading. And then I just start laying out my towel in my pajamas. I should say pajamas, but it's just my uniform still. And then that's when I start getting ready. So I hang up my towel and then I usually take off my Apple Watch and start plugging this in. And this Apple Watch is a Series 8. And if you're wanting an Apple Watch that works pretty good, this is it. Brush my teeth and that's when I start getting ready to shower for the night. So time to relax and i usually always read before i go to bed and this just helps to calm my brain so good night